Welcome to Swiss Cheese Trails. I'm high above the Emmentaler region. Look at these rolling hills on both sides. Come and subscribe. I'm hiking across the country of Switzerland, learning about the culture and the food production and the mountains, the weather. Subscribe, come along, walk across the country in VR, 360 degree video. Guten Tag, Today I am hiking section 16 of the Swiss Alpine Panorama Trail. I'm starting off on this excellent bench. When I see a bench like this, I, I tend to stop. Yeah, especially, I mean, you don't see a bench like this unless there's a great view. And uh, today is no exception. So we're in the town of Mooseg, Mooseg. Um, you may spin around and see a red car trying to park next to the house here. Um, that is a nice lady who is from here and we had a conversation about the bench. Um, she doesn't speak English, but uh, as I said in the last section, my German is getting a little bit better where I can at least greet people and understand what we're talking about. Uh, so I did combine uh, the second half of section 15 uh, with the entirety of section 16 here today that we're about to do. Uh, so I've been hiking for a little over an hour, hour and a half, something like that. Um, and I grabbed one of my egg sandwiches on a pretzel, pretzel bun from the local bakery. Uh, and that's going to be my lunch rather than uh, eating at the Elp House here. Uh, the moose egg, moose egg, <laughs> I want to say, I really want to say the word moose. Um, the lodge, main lodge, where the trail from section 15 um, spikes over. Pretty crowded, lots of events going on there. Um, certainly a great place to eat. It was uh, very busy. Uh, I'm hearing a lot of laughter from this other Alp house here, which is just old style gorgeous. And you can see the lady uh, coming home. So I guess that's her house, wow. <laughs> because that's a beautiful house. I just took a picture in front of it. <laughs> uh, so I'm excited about this. You know, it's a little overcast. Um, some of this should burn off. Not all of it, though. Uh, looking south, we're looking uh, toward the Bernese Oberlin. We are going to be hiking today uh, through uh, the Emmentaler region and uh, into the uh, air air. Boy, oh boy, the R.A. River, which is the primary river through Bern, um, and that goes upstream, south, upstream, toward the Alps, uh, through the city of Thun, which I have some great video of, and uh, then into Lake Thun, uh, where on the other side, the southern side of Lake Thun is Interlaken. I think I explained this at the end of the last video, which is the gateway. Uh, not not a great city, but it's a gateway to all the great things uh, that happen in the Jungfrau Eiger, Grindelwald, Latorbrüten area of Switzerland, um, just the heart of the Bernese Oberland. So we're going to see those mountains uh, as we go into section 17. I'll talk about my four-day uh, Swiss adventure with the local... Um, hiking outlet, Tranza, which is much like the REI of the United States. And they put on uh, a little more adventurous uh, activities twice a year. They do uh, one is the four day uh, Swiss classic, which I participated in and you tent camp. And then uh, there's also a hoot uh, walk, which is much higher altitude where you're going from hut to hut. And, um, I'll have to get that under my belt at some point. All right, so I'm excited for today. We're going to knock this out. We're going to get into some beautiful, beautiful sightseeing. Not that the last part hasn't been that way. And, and I should say, as I left off the last video for section 15, we are halfway through the country. This is the middle mark. Um, so we've done a lot. <laughs> All right, I'm going to have lunch now. Thanks for joining. Don't forget to subscribe.